Queen Camilla exudes diplomatic flair and triumphs in a solo trip to Northern Ireland. Queen Camilla stunned onlookers in a green outfit that designer Bruce Oldfield initially claimed was very elegant for Christmas Day. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss anything about the British royal family. Queen Camilla's fashion in Northern Ireland reflects a careful reconstruction of the relationship between the country and the royal family. The Queen was praised for her choice of clothing and accessories, as she spent the day carrying out a wide range of engagements. She started by meeting local small business owners in Belfast, including Coffee's Butchers, Arcadia Delicatessen, and Knott's Craft Bakery. Camilla then visited the rifles at Thiepville Barracks in Lisburn where she received the royal salute and watched the parade perform a double march in her honour. In the evening, Her Majesty headed to Hillsborough Castle to receive the Foreign Minister, the First Minister and the Deputy First Minister of Northern Ireland. Queen Camilla mastered the art of diplomatic dressing during her visit to Northern Ireland, and relied on trusted friend Bruce Oldfield to come to her rescue. The Queen's dark green look and shamrock brooch paid tribute to the close relationship between the two countries. Decades ago, the troubles in Northern Ireland greatly affected the country's relationship with the monarchy, but things have been put right. When she arrived to greet crowds in Northern Ireland's capital Belfast, Camilla's wardrobe was already displaying her diplomatic efforts. The dark green coat was designed by one of Camilla's favourites, Bruce Oldfield, and featured velvet leaves on the top. Oldfield told The Telegraph that the papers were a modern, stylized interpretation of the classic Rococo leaf form. Queen Camilla accessorized her leafy coat with a beautiful fitting shamrock brooch. Brooches are a favorite piece of jewelry among the royal family, and this piece is made of diamonds and turquoise in the shape of an Irish clover. The piece was owned by the late Queen Elizabeth, who gave it to Camilla after she herself received it as a wedding gift in 1947. Her Majesty is clearly fond of the shamrock brooch, with royal watchers noting that she has been wearing it exclusively since 2019. This stunning piece of Persian turquoise jewellery is set in the centre of three diamond shamrock leaves, and there is a larger diamond in the centre of the brooch. Express.co.uk previously spoke to Maxwell Stone, Stephen Stone's leading diamond expert, about the value of the piece. He said, It features three leaves of Persian turquoise surrounded by high-quality white diamonds and estimated that this exceptional piece is worth approximately £25,000. For her evening engagement, Queen Camilla wore a different green outfit that still complemented her other looks throughout the day. She hosted an event at Hillsborough Castle as part of the Queen's Reading Room to celebrate World Poetry Day. Camilla was joined by poets Sinead Morrissey and Raquel Mackey, actress Frances Tumulty, poet Michael Longley, actor Ian McElhenney and poet Paul Muldoon.